AITA for refusing to give back wedding gifts to my MIL after my husband passed. My husband passed away about three years ago. We were together for nine years, married for four years at the time of his passing. He never had a great relationship with his parents, and he was very vocal about that to all of our friends. My husband and I kept our finances very private and did not share much with his parents, as my husband did not want them to be involved. His parents are decently well off and can provide for themselves. We would openly share finances with my parents and during the term of our marriage, we have taken financial help from my parents when needed, but we have never asked his parents to help us out at any time. My husband and I also had a home that we purchased together while we were engaged. I had some legal issues and his parents did have to sign a document as we did not have a living will. They hesitated and his mom kept making snarky comments about the car I drive and shoes I buy. It was resolved eventually, but I think the process just gave me a bitter feeling. His parents waited to see if their names were listed as beneficiary for any accounts we had and after it was confirmed that they were not they stopped contacting me. Last time they spoke to me was two years ago. I have started to see someone new over the past year and they are clearly not happy. It's become a why should she have anything from our son mentality. I also lost my mom about six months ago. A few weeks ago his parents called and demanded I give them all the wedding jewelry back that was received for our 2017 wedding as it is not mine and belongs to his MOM. Nothing given from any guests or his parents during the wedding was family heirlooms or passed down jewelry that would have sentimental value. They were just gifts from those who attended our wedding. They did not even show up to my mother's funeral or call me. They are also claiming that the home we had isn't even mine as their son put the down payment. Untrue as my parents had helped us put a large amount of the down payment for that home, but my husband never shared that with his parents since we never wanted to make rub it in their faces. They also think that their son funded everything and our entire lifestyle, which is another lie as we had built our life with money that was made by both of us, not just him. In my perspective, I was married to their son, we both worked, built a life together, and any gifts given to me during my wedding or things purchased between money that their son and I made is not theirs. His mother has been harassing and calling my family, and it has been non-stop comments, to the point where she questioned my upbringing that my deceased mother gave me. All my family members think they are disgusting to do this to their son's widow, but it also gets awkward as we are trying to be mindful that they lost their son. My heart still goes out to them for their loss, as I can imagine they are also grieving, but I am just confused. If you liked this video, make sure you hit the like button and comment down below your thoughts. Also don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell for more videos like this.